smells of a baddie. Yep, that's my dirty work right there. I've developed quite the reputation throughout my life. Basically, I'm the last person you want to run into alone in a dark seedy alleyway. I take great pride in being a villain. Lying, cheating, stealing, money laundering, giving and taking bribes, bets, hostages. And let's not forget my specialties of torture and murder. I even worked as a used car salesman. It's always the same question that I'm asked. Why do I do such horrific deeds? Aren't I afraid of the devil, of going to hell? But I'm not afraid because I already know I'm going to hell. In fact, I've known since I was six years old when I initially sold my soul to the devil. Although in hindsight, I wish I had waited until I was older so that I could have gotten more than a bottomless tub of ice cream. But at least the devil makes a sinful gelato. I also have an army of demons at my disposal. Per my agreement with old Satan, I command an army of demons to protect me from ever getting caught. I've had some close calls, but they always advise me on what to do and have even possessed people. Life has been great until recently when I was tricked by one of the demons and had a fatal accident. Now I have this asshole that calls me his pet and is assigned to torture me for eternity. But I really can't complain. I knew how this was going to end for me. Also, I have seen heaven and trust me, their kind of torture is so much worse. And yes, yeah, hot down here, but I always have ice cream. I'm sorry, sir. No outside food or beverages are allowed.